Hey there, today I'm going to show you how you can set a world spawn in Minecraft Education Edition. So today's tutorial is going to be nice and quick and I'm going to show you how you can set your world spawn. And what that means is that when you or someone else enters the world, that is where they're going to appear, of course, unless you have been kind of walking around already playing because you always just reappear where you were. The reason why we do this is students can quite often uh, go build you something, then they give you the world, but you don't spawn in the same position that they are in. They You spawn wherever the world is set to let you spawn, which sometimes can be miles or feels like miles away. So they do need to set that spawn position for you. So let's have a look at how we do that. So what we do on our keyboard is we hit enter and it opens up our chat and command bar. From here, I'm going to write in forward slash and then set. And then you will see that three options have come up there for set it for being able to set something. And so we're looking at the bottom one. So I'm just gonna keep writing there. There is a little tricky. You can also just hit tab, which will um, write out the rest for you as well. And then I'll hit enter. And we can see there on the left-hand side of the screen, it says set world spawn position to 175, 33, minus two. And that is pretty much it. Now, what do those numbers mean? If you wanna keep watching, I'll explain that for you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit escape. I'm going to go settings and down here i'm going to show coordinates so those numbers are my coordinates they're where i'm standing so if you could remember there in the same position there up at the top left hand corner it says position 175 33 minus 2. that's exactly the same so if i was to move so i'm going to go move somewhere else so you can see that those numbers are changing Okay, the middle one's not gonna change unless I jump up like this, but we've got completely different numbers now. So if I was to do the same thing, I was to go forward slash, set world, hit tab and enter, have a look. Those numbers are exactly the same. They're identical or almost identical. We're one off there, but that's okay. But they're almost identical to each other. So it's wherever I'm standing is where my world spawn is going to be which means that if students start entering in this world now, they will basically land exactly where I'm standing. Now, another way to set that world spawn is to also, if we hit enter, and instead of writing in forward slash set spawn, is that here, if I click on the forward slash, so I'm down in the bottom um, left-hand corner there, our options will come up and you can just see that it's also there. So I can click on set world spawn there and it will write it out for me. Okay. I will still need to hit enter. Oh, actually, no, I won't. I will need to click a little um, bottom there. I just needed to move myself out of the way. Click that and it's going to set that world spawn position for us again. So super handy to know. I hope you found that useful and we'll see you again soon. Cheers.